Use the graph of y equals f of x to graph the function g of x equals f of negative x minus 3. So whenever we have a negative sign in front of the x, we reflect across the other axis. So it's in front of the x, so we reflect across the y-axis. If instead it was something like this, then this is our y. So it's kind of like negative y. Um, so in this case, we would reflect across the x-axis. So whenever you have a negative, just reflect across the other axis. So in this case, negative in front of the x, reflect across the y-axis. In this case, negative in front of the y, reflect across the x-axis. So we're reflecting across the y-axis, and then this minus 3 means we're going down 3. So let's go to this picture here. So we're flipping this. We're reflecting it across the y-axis, and we're going down 3. Looks like the correct choice here would be choice C. Quick check answer, and that's it. I hope that made sense.